Hello everyone, I'm Heather Newman, Microsoft Ignite community reporter for 2019. I'm coming to you today from my office in Marina Del Rey and I thought I'd share some event tips and tricks with you. You're probably asking why I have curlers in my hair. Well, two years ago, uh, before Ignite, Ducks, Meet Ducks on Twitter and I got together, we were recording a webinar and I had my curlers in and we were getting prepped and he, we said, well, let's just do them with them in. And so thus something called the curler report launched that day and I've been doing these on my Instagram uh, wherever I am in the world and talking about what I'm doing, where I am and uh, depending on where I'm speaking about those shows. So I thought I'd leave them in for you and there will be one every day at Ignite to start the morning to tell you what's going on. I'll probably do some without the curlers in when I'm running around uh, the expo hall but uh, for today you get the curler report. Uh, a few tips and tricks about Ignite. Um, I have been at Ignite for the past four years and I have another, goodness, uh, since 2003, Tech Ed's, what it used to be called, under my belt as well, both as an event producer, as a partner, as a sponsor, as a speaker, and as a Microsoft MVP. So um, I'm always learning at these events because they're always different, but there's a few things that uh, maybe you wanna pick up and know. First, water bottle. Make sure you bring a water bottle and keep hydrated. It's super duper important. The other thing is extra batteries. Uh, make sure you have one charging in your hotel room and one with you. It's really important to keep those up with you. There's a really wonderful app uh, for the event that's got maps, that has learning paths, that has where the shuttles are, all those kinds of things. So if you haven't downloaded the app already, be sure to do so. Um, I am one of 10 community reporters uh, that will be running around Ignite, and uh, I have put up a Twitter list of all of them at Creative Mavens uh, on one of my businesses that I run, uh, which is a marketing consultancy. So if you go to Creative Mavens and you look up Microsoft Ignite Community Reporters, you can follow us all there and get in on the action. Um, the hashtag for Microsoft is Ignite is Hashtag MS Ignite, pretty simple. So make sure you're tagging that in all of your posts. Um, let's see, we're also gonna be uh, on the live stage interviewing lots of wonderful people. I can't tell you yet who that is, but I'm really excited about it. Um, and I'm scheduling interviews with folks along the way. I will most likely be in the uh, in the hub at probably the Humans of IT Lounge, hanging out there when I'm um, not running around. So if you wanna catch me there, that's where I'll be. Um, some things from a couple of years ago, the community reporters over the last two years have put together some really great tips and tricks themselves and blogs as well, which I've linked uh, in the blog post that goes along with this video. Um, a few other things. Um, there are ATMs and money change machines uh, at the North, South, and West concourses of the OCC and the Hyatt, unless they've moved. Um, there's also a 24-hour diner at the Hyatt Regency Hotel just from the OCCC. It's called the Beeliner Diner, and they're there. Uh, I spent one night uh, speaking to somebody very late uh, and catching up, so it's a great place to go. Um, just so you know, it's kind of cool. The uh, OCCC is the second largest convention facility in the U.S. They host about 230 events in the Central Florida area, bringing in 1.4 million attendees, and they contribute about 2.4 billion to the area's economy. So it's pretty cool. Um, the OCCC is 12 miles. Uh, that is the Orange County Convention Center. Uh, it's 12 miles from the Orlando Airport, and uh, as are most conference hotels. So you can take Uber, Lyft, and taxis and all of that to get to where you need to be. Um, there's a lot of pedicabs also around the convention center. Sometimes sponsors sponsor those of the show, so uh, keep an eye about that. Tipping is customary uh, based on the service provided. Uh, again, those battery charges, I'm, I'm gonna say that again, battery chargers are so important. Um, and the other thing is shoes, uh, multiples. Um, this is a business casual tech event, right? So carry maybe an extra pair of shoes or flip-flops in your backpack. I also highly recommend a backpack rather than something slung over. It's whatever you prefer, of course, but backpacks are great because you're not gonna get that shoulder thing on the side, right? Um, also, uh, bring a refresher. Don't wear the same shoes every day. You should also maybe, I don't know, be gelling um, or uh, super feet are a great insert as well uh, to help with that because it doesn't really matter if you don't walk and you're sitting in sessions. It's just the conference center is huge and so you're going to be walking a lot and you're going to be standing a lot. So the other thing is sit down whenever you can. Also, go to the bathroom whenever you can. Fill up your water bottle whenever you can. Um, it's a marathon, you know, um, and so you got to prepare for it. Um, the other thing is, uh, talking about Twitter earlier, 
uh, do connect with folks and do that before you get on site because you don't want to hunt and peck, you know, for things there. So um, people that you're going to go see speak, uh, definitely, you know, grab them on your Twitter and follow them um, because then, you know, if you hear something cool in one of the, uh, not if, let's say when, you hear something cool in one of the sessions, then you can easily tweet that out. Uh, speakers love that sort of thing and it's a great way to connect with them. Take a photo, give a tweet, a quote, something like that. Um, and, you know, all of those at Microsoft Teams, at OneDrive, at SharePoint, at Office 365, at Azure, um, at OneNote. You know, my, you're my favorite. But anyway, um, <laughs> uh, the other thing is, you know, eat as well. There's really, the, the, they do a really good job with having healthy snacks as well. But um, I always travel with, I buy um, some nuts and some beef jerky and things that I like to eat and have those in my bag for those moments when I just can't get to something, you know, or I've missed it, you know, if I've missed the food. But usually uh, there's something available for you um, no matter what. Um, the other thing that I think is important is um, there's a Oh, oh my goodness, a heck of a lot of people that produce these events. And they um, are usually wearing all blacks and have headsets on. And, um, you know, a thank you to them for doing what they do is always super appreciated as an event producer um, for these events in the past. Um, it's always nice when somebody says, hey, great job, or thank you, that sort of thing. And also our sponsors. The sponsors make these events happen along with the event production team and Microsoft. So, you know, thank them. They're paying to be there and to show you what they're doing and to tell you about their um, awesome products and services they have. So, you know, a little thank you is nice for them as well. Um, Let's see, certain sessions aren't recorded. So, um, and the thing is, is that there's a lot that will be. So, you know, choose choose your path wisely. There are learning paths um, in the app and on the site that you can guide, you know, that can kind of guide you. Um, but definitely kind of check out and see, you know, a lot of the community theater stuff and things that are gonna happen in the hub are not gonna be recorded. So um, those are things that, you know, if you want that um, in-person action, definitely make sure and put those on your list. Um, I also, with Ignite, you know, it's a big show. So the other thing is, is that when you're walking between things, you know, make sure you have enough time. We were talking today and it's a little bit like being at a festival in a way, you know, it's like you got to pick your favorite artist and, uh, and follow that track, you know, so make sure you're giving yourself enough time as well to do what you need to do. Um, keynotes are going to be all over. There's going to be viewing all over uh, for our keynotes. And so definitely check that out. Um, there's some, there's like main space, but there's lots of other spaces for keynote viewing. Um, another cool place, um, Community Central, um, that's great. And the, there's the podcast studio, Community Central. There's Microsoft Mechanics. Uh, there's the Humans of IT Lounge that I mentioned before. Um, those are great places for viewing as well. There's a whole area where you can sit and put on headphones and um, listen to uh, whatever you want to listen to. So definitely pay attention to that and see that, you know, it's great being in the room, of course, but, you know, sometimes it's nice to just sit down for a second, put those headphones on and give a listen. So those are all great things um, to think about as you're planning um, your trip. I think most of all, have fun, you know, and um, I know that there's a lot of people who are first timers and also people who are introverts, uh, people who are extroverts or introverts masking as introverts. Um, and so, you know, it's really good to, um, you know, feel free to introduce yourself to people if you see somebody standing by themselves. Another really good tip is if you are um, standing in a circle, um, you know, you can't really break through a circle, right? So make it a you instead and keep it open so people can come and approach you and say hello. So anyway, those are a few tips and tricks from me. I'm at Hedda Newman, H-E-D-D-A-N-E-W-M-A-N, -E -E a Czechoslovakian director back in my past called me Hedda and it's stuck. Um, I'll be posting there and I'll be also be posting on uh, my company Content Panda's YouTube channel, all these fun videos on Instagram, on Twitter, on LinkedIn and all that stuff. So um, I cannot wait to get to Ignite. I cannot wait to see so many of you. Um, if you're trying to get a hold of me, definitely uh, DM me and say hi, uh, but I'll probably be hanging out at that Humans of IT lounge uh, when I'm not doing other things that I've uh, been scheduled to do. So wonderful, yay, have a great time and I'll see you in Orlando.